Hello guys, welcome back to Divine Time Sarah. This is my Oops, excuse me guys. <laughs> I'm sorry. If you're new to the channel, welcome. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Cross watchers, you're always welcome. Hello, Divine Time and Tarot family. Thank you. Appreciate you. Sorry about that, y'all. Here doing a video for Pisces. Um, this is for November the 16th to the 30th. This is a general reading. It's for someone rising and Venus. Pisces, I've already shuffled Sage, prayed over the cards, okay? Okay, so I'm getting for you, Pisces, um, the cards, your overall energies with sacred space, okay? So it's time for you to create an altar or visit a, a power place to connect with the divine. So divine is trying to get your attention about something here, okay? You also have the fertility card, which is the Empress. You know who you are, okay? You know your worth. This is a time, this is a perfect time for you to start new projects, access new ideas, and give birth to new conditions, okay? I'm hearing, I also heard that you're very authentic, okay? You are who you are. There's only one of you. And hey, that's how divine has us anyway, you know? There's only one of us, okay? But there's something very special about you, Pisces. I don't know what it is. I'm just telling you what I'm hearing, okay? And it's time for you to stop trying to do everything for yourself. Start delegating things to other people, you know? Ask for help. Call on the divine. Call on your angels, you know? Um, don't You don't have to do everything by yourself, okay? That's what I was getting also. So let's see what else is going on with Pisces for... November the 16th to the 30th. I'm also getting that you're very curious about something. I don't know what's going on, but you're curious about something. It looks like you possibly ended something. Something that you've been working on. Some possibly a relationship you've been in for a long period of time. And now, you know, it's over. You're done. You know, you had to put it to an end. You're just pretty much concentrating on your money right now. Let's see. What do we have for Pisces? What is the situation here with Pisces, guys? What is the situation? We have the Magician. This is a very beautiful card. What are you manifesting? And you have everything in your power to manifest the things that you want. But yeah, you're manifesting something here. The Magician coming right out of the bag with the Magician. Okay, what else is going on? Ooh. Yeah, some of you guys have ended something. I don't know. But um, could be you're manifesting your stability here. We got the Four of Wands, the Unity card. <clears throat> your foundation. I'm going to go ahead and take these cards that fell out, and, and, and I'm feeling that I'm supposed to. Okay, so something is transforming here. The transformation card. This is the death card. <clears throat> so something has ended here for you. Or you've put some, or you've ended something, okay? Yeah, the eight of cups. You walked away from something or someone that was very emotional. So could have been a relationship. Could have been dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio like yourself, Leo, Sag, Aries, Scorpio. Your present moment, someone wants to reunite with you with the Three of Cups. This is celebration. This is celebration. But we'll see what else goes on because the Three of Cups can also, this is something that's going on in your present moment. Someone wanted to reunite with you. But it can also represent, you know, possibly a third party situation. You've definitely ended something. Patience. Got the three of wands. You're waiting on something. You're having patience and you're waiting on something. You're waiting on something else to come in. Something that you're manifesting here, Pisces. What are you manifesting? Let's see what we have at the bottom of the deck. We have the higher fonts. Ooh. Commitment. <clears throat> Commitment. And then underneath that, we have the Two of Pentacles. 
and the eight of pentacles somebody wants to work on a marriage here okay okay so something possibly ended in a marriage because of a third party situation because we also have the three of swords this is heartbreak this is sadness this is disappointment but somebody's wanting to come back together and work on the situation Pisces. is that you or are you manifesting this stability back into your situation let's see let's let's see let's see let's see let's um clarify why is the magician here with the four of wands like i told you you are manifesting stability here you possibly manifesting somebody back into your life also pisces why is the magician here with the four of wands guys thank you so much huh we have the five of swords which is manipulation Trying to win at all costs. Hmm. Why is the Five of Swords here? Maybe someone was, was very manipulative in a situation. In a marriage. And then we have the Two of Wands. You're at a crossroads here. I think you're kind of confused with this Five of Swords being here. I think you're in your head a lot about this situation. You're not really knowing what you, if you want it or if you don't want it. You're at a crossroads. You're not knowing which way to go. You don't know if you want to go or if you want to stay. Why is transformation here? Which is the death card. OMG, the death card again. Wow. Why is the death card here for the second time? Something definitely ended. You definitely could have been dealing with a Scorpio also. There was a lot of gossip going on. Possibly a lot of spying with the Page of Swords here. Um, stalking. Gathering up information about a situation. Why is the Eight of Cups here? Why did you walk away? This is possibly why you walked away. Why is the Eight of Cups here? I think you knew that there was something going on in this situation. We got three, three, two threes here. We know that there was a third party here, okay? The Eight of Cups is the Four of Cups. This is a missed opportunity. You're thinking, universe was offering you something, and you're thinking about taking that offer that universe is offering you. You don't want to think about the past anymore. You don't want to think about the things that went on in the past. Yeah. You want to walk away from everything that happened in the past. You got the Eight of Cups here twice. This is definitely a missed opportunity from for someone. Whoever you're walking away from, Pisces, they are definitely going to feel it. Why is the Three of Cups here? Because they already wanted to reunite with you. This is the Knight of Pentacles. Somebody waited too long here to make an offer. Why is the Three of Cups here? This was definitely a wish fulfillment of yours, Pisces. Or you were a wish fulfillment for someone. But someone waited too long to, to give an offer to you. And you walked away. This person was possibly dealing with someone else. The Tower. Something unexpected went down here. Because someone was taking too long. Someone was taking too long. The situation was not stable, nor was it grounded. Okay, why is the three of wands here? You, you, you turned your back on it. You turned your back on it. We have justice here. You're waiting for something that's going to be very equal and balanced for you. Well, if, you if you guys are going through some legal issues, it's going to turn in your favor. Yeah, you're waiting. You're, you're investing something here, and you're waiting to see how it's going to come to fruition. Like I said in the beginning, you're, mani you're, you're manifesting. You're manifesting something, and you've invested in something or someone. Could be a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn, and you're waiting to see how this is going to turn out. Why is the Seven of Pentacles here? One more time. Seven of Pentacles. Why is the Seven of Pentacles here? Uh. We have the Five of Wands. This is competition. Um, 
fussing rivalry. This is rivalry here. Rivalry here. Let's see. Yeah, there's a decision here that you have to make, Pisces, with this Two of Swords. Could be dealing with the Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. You definitely need to use your intuition because there is some secrets around you. Could be dealing with a Gemini, okay? Um, there could be two people also here, okay? Either you or the person that you're dealing with has to make a decision between two people. Guys, what is the outcome here? And then we'll get some advice. What's the outcome here for Pisces? What is the outcome here for Pisces, guys? What is the outcome? Give me an outcome for Pisces. Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody wants to work on it. I was just getting ready to say that, Pisces. I think you possibly wanted to work out something here, but you're not really sure. Use your intuition because your guides are letting you know everything that you need to know. You know, connect with the divine because they will tell you everything that you need to know. What is the outcome here for Pisces, guys? What's the outcome? What's the outcome? What is the outcome? Ooh. <sighs> he gave me two of two cards. Okay. You have the three of swords, which is great sadness, um, betrayal. So I'm getting universe is saying, if you continue on in the situation where there's a third party, it's just going to end up in heartbreak. And it's time for you possibly to start something new and creative. This is the empress here. Um, this is starting out some, this is starting something new. Because you know your worth. You know who you are. What is the advice? What's the advice? That's part, that's that's really advice and um outcome and advice. But let's get one more piece of advice here. Let's get one more piece of advice. Someone is definitely here, Pisces, dealing with someone else. So what is what is the advice? Universe, give us some advice. Universe is wanting you to stay strong, control your emotions with the strength card here. And it's time for you to do some soul searching. It's time for you to step back from this situation. Um, get alone. Connect with the divine. And, you know, just get to know you. Because you, like I said in the beginning, you are very unique here, okay? You know who you are. You're the empress or the emperor. You know your worth. And this situation here is not going to be good for you. You're worth better. You're worth more than this situation. If someone feels that um, they have to deal with you and another person, you're not an option. You are definitely not an option. Okay, Pisces? If this resonates with you, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you. Bye-bye.